kind of laid up here in Warner Springs at the community center. Thinking, waiting for Shaylin to be able to come get me, and I'm gonna take some time off and probably more than I feel like I should, just to make sure my feet get super healed up and look at some shoes, maybe. I don't know if it's just like having the zero drop shoes for the first time, it's just like wrecking my feet or, or what it is. So I'm gonna at least go try on some others and I'll make that decision, but I don't know when when he's gonna be able to actually come get me. So I already had one night here and might have another. We'll, we'll see, but it's really nice getting to meet some cool people and you know, hang out in this chair. Made it back to 29 to zero for a bit since my feet are so bad. I'm gonna look at some new shoes. Took a shower, put on a face mask, it's pampering myself. And I absolutely forgot about this horrendous photo that lives in our house. It's so creepy. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna do some icing and heating on my feet and Hopefully in a three or four days, five days, get back out. We'll see. Bye. Got my foot on this heating pad and uh, Riley here is helping out, I guess, trying to get my foot all yelled up. I don't know. See you, dog. my six zero day now so it's time for my Epsom salt hot water foot soak <laughs> hopefully doing this and icing and stuff is helping but I am still having some pain kind of uh, right here in the bone so it's probably stress fractures yay but uh, hopefully just this rest and then the new shoes with more cushioning uh, will kind of like at least let me walk more miles on it. I don't know if I'm going to get back on trail tomorrow or Tuesday. I'm trying to figure out where my little group is so I can meet back up with them. And then miles that I missed, I'll hike this fall when I get back since we live super close. So but yeah, time to soak my feet and eat some Chinese food. Bye. So, maybe last day before I go back and meet up with everybody on trail in Big Bear, but I'm doing one last little Epsom salt bath for my feet, and I'm gonna have some wine, and, uh, but yeah, I'm drying out all my stuff. I, was, I mean, it's dry, just kind of airing it out, some of the stink, but, uh, these are the new shoes that I purchased. 
that hopefully will be better for my feet. I don't know. Um, I tricked them out with some Velcro for my gaiters and added these little, I don't know if you can see them, these little uh, loop thing here so it'd be easier to hook my gaiters on since, you know, Ultras already have all that cool stuff built into them. I had to kind of make it myself, but these are the Hoka 1-1 Speed Goat 2s. Um, they're not a zero drop shoe, so hopefully that'll be what my body is kind of more used to. And they have this like really thick midsole, so I'm very hopeful that the extra cushioning from that will uh, in turn help the balls of my feet not hurt so bad and get feel like I have stone bruises all the time. Uh, Got some other stuff at REI that I have forgotten about, so it's kind of going to be a fun game of what did I get. Oh yeah, some more beef jerky. I got these uh, champagne gummy bears. I'm interested to try those out. I got this little ball to roll out my feet, so hopefully that'll help a little bit. I don't know. more olive snacks and a new watch because uh, my watch band is taped together it's been broken it broke like a year ago and I've been taping it together for a year so time for a new one so I got a new watch nothing fancy just a cheap Timex <laughs> one day I'll have a fancy like Garmin watch or something I don't know probably not but yeah that's, that's all I got Yep, the rest of Shaylin stuff, but gonna wait to hear from Carl and find out kind of where they are, but they're gonna get to Big Bear tomorrow or Friday and meet up with them. I assume they're gonna be zeroing there, so I'll kind of be zeroing a little longer just to hang out with them and then hit the trail. Um, and then all the miles that I missed between Warner Springs and Big Bear, I'll come back and hike this fall. Uh, um, yeah, I just really want to stay with my little hiking family that I made and since I live right here it won't be too difficult to go back and hike those like 150 miles I missed uh, but yeah um, it was kind of hard to make the decision to do that like weighing the options of like is it really a true through hike if I skip miles and then come back and do them or you know but I want to hike with my friends <laughs> that I made so maybe they'll help keep me motivated to keep going and like keep the morale up with all the injuries I've been having but um, yeah, so kind of decided to go with the stay with your friends kind of thing and, you know, hike my own hike. But, uh, oh yeah, I haven't mentioned yet, Carl gave me my trail name back at Warner Springs and I forgot to mention it. So my trail name now is Tidbits because I always have little like fun facts and tidbits about kind of everything. So I'm officially Tidbits now. But yeah, so I will check back in with you guys. Um, when I catch back up with my little trail family. Bye.